Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at the Pure AF Speed with Extras by KJ Nook. So without wasting more time, let's start. So guys, this ROM is based on Pure AOSP, like it's Pure AOSP from the Google GID. And then you can see into about phone, into Android 9, you can see the build number AOSP wired it user debug. Android version 9 and also with the latest February 5, 2019 security badges. And it uses the stock kernel and you can see the tag is 4.4.173. So guys, this ROM comes with all your SPFs, but I have just like disabled them and installed Google Apps for some good like new material design and all. Then let's move into settings and let's see what it has by extras. Into extras, you can see those additional settings. Then into status bar, you can see traffic indicators and status bar items, your normal system stuff, getting into navigation bar. So you can see we had enable navigation bar and navbar buttons into, sorry, gestures. We get the navigation gestures and three finger gesture. Into volume, we get the volume steps. Into power menu, we get power advanced restart and other power menu stuff. Power menu stuff, lock screen, we get the lock screen shortcuts. Like not a lot of amounts because this is pure SP, AOSP, so let's keep it pure. System, we get in-call notifications and in-call vibrations like the call on like vibrate on connect, vibrate on call waiting and vibrate on disconnect. So awesome feature here. We also get the ambient display feature in display settings and we have your new notification and also advanced settings for doors. So you can see hand wave and pocket and pickup. So guys, this ROM doesn't have a camera or I don't know, like I dirty flashed the newer build from the older build and my MIUI camera is removed and also the change lock says removed MIUI camera. So you can see there is no camera, so you need to install any Gcam and also if uh, like camera to API is not enabled by default, I didn't check it. So I will just leave the camera to API as if you need to flash it after booting into the ROM and then you can install any Gcam. So guys, let's start with the PUBG test. It's kind of PUBG test and review and it's pure SP. So there are no most framework modifications for some awesome features like very less features available. So like you can get more space for free RAM and PUBG. Oh, wow. You are knocked out in the air. Okay. There's one more. Oh my God. Okay. Uh, I got knocked out. So yeah. Uh, it's really fair pubg plays really well there are no lags i'm playing this uh game on this device for like two to three days and faced no lag and plays well on hd graphics so this is really well and yeah that's it uh sorry i died earlier but yeah that's just how to show you how the graphics work and there is no lag and guys uh, now we are starting with and benchmark so yeah let's wait till it ends and let's check the score afterwards so guys the antidote benchmark is done and this is the score one like thirteen thousand six 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 triple six and you can see the cpu score is 54 at 37 gpu score is 21 328 ux is 31 522 and memory 5979 and you can see it's a refresh 33 percent of users in ux so it's pure sp and also the overall score defeated 26 percent of users so yeah that's good so you can like compare the scores and then decide what is the entire score all about. And yeah, I just like, I don't actually look about the entire score. I like take a look at the actual performance it does. So yeah. So guys, now taking a look at the battery details, you can see now this is my previous battery details. Now the latest, the build I am on, I just flashed it today because it lost like released today. So I cannot like use it again. You can see I played PUBG for 2 hours and 11 minutes and the screen on time I got is 8 hours 12 minutes and it was like 30 hours ago. So you can see this is the battery graph. You do, I don't like use all of the apps but some apps I've used and they are not there like Instagram and all so I don't know why. But yeah, that is the battery usage. So guys, that's it for the review for the AOSP by KJ Noob which is based on the pure AOSP and the latest security patch and also the latest tracks. So that's it guys for the video. If you guys really like this video, press the like button. If not, press the dislike button. Also, if you want more videos on the Redmi Note 5 Pro and other devices, you can like subscribe to my channel and also press the bell icon if you want. And yeah, bye-bye. I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.